in this chapter we are going to look what is the difference between close and quick in a detailed way okay so if you remember in our in our previous lecture we have written this chrome driver uh, constructor we have loaded this url and we have done the login script but when i run the script let me show you so it's going to run execute properly that's not the problem but the browser doesn't close so there is a problem if the browser doesn't get closed always let me show you that what is the problem in terms of memory as well okay so here you can see that the script got completed the browser is still open and if i go back to my eclipse you can see that the script is completed right now if i right click and click on the task bar and if i click on the task manager you can see that uh, if i update this i mean if i expand this you can see that we have lots of memory wastage here so here you can see that it says like chrome driver one two three four so we have plenty of chrome drivers opens and that is of course it's going to consume your system memory right so the memory might be little low like four or five but but i think that if you are going to continuously run all your script like if you have like 100 test case or 1000 test case then of course it's going to waste your memory so in two ways actually one way we can we can solve this in one way by using the function called driver dot quit uh, let me show you that okay uh, before that i like to click kill all my browser instance so in our previous lecture also we saw the code for that or the command for that if you remember you can just type before me okay so i'm going to say task kill slash f slash m and then i'm going to say chrome driver dot exe right now as soon as i enter you can see that it closed almost like six instance to confirm we can go again to our task manager and now in this time you can see we do not have anything here with the name of chrome driver right so that means all the things have displayed i mean terminated and here you can see google chrome that is basically all the browsers that we have opened over here okay if you want to close all the browsers we can do that instead of chrome driver we have to say chrome.exe and here you can see that we have a lot of chromes opened and everything got closed here okay that's it now let us understand the real difference between close and quit i hope you got this scenario right now when i say driver.close it's going to close the browser but is that really going to save our memory let's see so i'm going to right click and i'm going to run as java application So login is completed and the script also got closed i mean completed and also the browser got closed right but let me show you the real thing if i go back to my task manager and if i go to this particular um, background processes and here you can see that the driver is actually doesn't closed the driver is not closed completely the task will doesn't happen that means it will consume our memory right so that is a problem then we have a function called quit if you use that function that means it is going to close the browser as well as it is going to terminate the process so that is the difference between close and quit let me show you that so if i go back to my task i mean command prompt and if i say task kill slash f slash im and then if i say chrome driver dot exe this time it's going to kill the process so if you go back and look in the task manager of course the chrome driver process won't be there because we have killed it right now instead of close i'm going to use quit here okay then right click and run as java application let us see what is going to happen this time so browser launched the script is going to run the completed everything stopped right now if i go to my command prompt and if i execute the same command and if i hit enter you can see that it says the processor chrome driver not found when i use the driver.close we can see that we are able to kill the process but when i use the driver.quit you can see that the process is not found that means the process already closed terminated right so that is the difference between close and quit so which one is used to recommend it of course the quit at the end of the script script not on the very first why because let's say that we have a scenario to for multiple tabs right so for example if i go to let code.in and here we have a scenario like we have this windows so once i click on this one you can see that we have two tabs now i want to close any of one tab not all the tabs in that scenario i have to use the function called driver.close to close the active tab 
but that will not kill my driver entry driver session but if i have to kill all the browsers that is opened by the selenium in the current session then of course i have to use the driver dot quit so i hope you understood the difference between close and quit we'll see that real time uses like how to use when to use in the window handling concept okay see you in the next lecture very soon